Hey, this is Matt from InvestiQuant. Today is Friday, October 21, 2022. Today is the options expiration day for the month of October. And that's what we'll be looking at this morning in today's daily IQ. So let me set it up here. We've got all four instruments. The setup's based upon entering long at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time and exiting at 4.15 p.m. Eastern Time. Now, for this study, we're going to use two pieces of information. We're going to use the month of October. I'm going to grab that from the calendar library. I'm going to go to the active today section. And I'm going to click on month of October right there. Now it's been added to the test. The next thing I'm going to do is go to the market events library. I'm going to go back to the active today. And I'm going to take that top option of options expiration day. Click on that. It has been added to the test. Now I can click view results. All right, here we go. These are the results based upon entering the market long at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time, exiting at 4.15 p.m. Eastern Time when it is October's option expiration day. Historically, we've got 19 samples that we're examining here, and that's for data going back to 2003. We've got win rates on these coming in at 53% for the S&P. That means 53% of these have closed above the opening print for the day. For the NASDAQ, it's weaker. It's 42%. The Dow... 58% and the Russell 32%. So win rates on these a bit mixed. A couple of these coming in weak on the 19 samples that we have here. If we look at the average moves, you'll see the average loss larger than the average win here in the S&P. That is also the case in the other instruments as well. So the NASDAQ sizably larger average loss compared to its average win. Uh, that's also the case here in the Dow and in the Russell. So historically speaking, bigger moves have taken place to the downside on this October options expiration day. Uh, win rates on these are mixed. We do just have 19 samples to look at, so not a huge sample size, um, but they do um, all have agreement on the average moves being larger to the downside on this day. Hopefully you found that helpful. Good luck today. We will see you next time.